watching this. But you'll sit there for God seven hours listening to people who sound like they're chewing blood. And be like, man, that's hard. Hip-hop head. Okay. All right. Yeah. Just because just because hip-hop is going inside your head don't mean you're hip-hop head. Last thing I'm going to say. Every rapper on the face of the fucking planet, if you got something to say about me and saying I ain't doing shit, put it on the microphone. You won't. Because I'll whoop your ass. You want to get spanked by a hillbilly? All right. Cross my Lamborghini, bitch. This is what a redneck millionaire is. Damn, Bob's on me. Damn, my weed, I'm a shit. What's good, Grand Shine Recovery? We're back at it. Up Church wants all the smoke. Johnny Gobble don't realize he contradicts his own lies. And, you know, Gobble Man, it's obvious you and your wife are up to something, bro. You don't come off sober. Um, she was pretty upset about whatever you didn't leave her the other day. First of all, let's get into Johnny's contradictory of himself and his lies. Check it out. I knew I'd never, I, I told y'all that I would never mention this guy's name, but I figured that I would share the pain that it's caused within my family. You know, when you go to a restaurant in your hometown and, and there's people making fun of you, you and your wife, and you're you you're having lunch with your wife and and want to take lunch and take her out to eat somewhere and and you get made fun of. That's it. It's a great feeling. How's everybody turn? <laughs> we'll put you outside if you're going live. I've already go. went live. Well, go. You're gonna put me outside. I yeah, right. I just got home. Go. I don't want to hear that shit. Okay. Go. <laughs> go. Take Bingo. Shit down there. I'm being to YouTube. I can tell. I thought you wouldn't get back on YouTube. I never said I wouldn't get back on YouTube. Oh, social media. When did I say that? Yesterday. You're a liar. You just called me a liar. <laughs> <laughs> no, we gotta go to him. I thought you said we had nothing there. We did. We did or we do? Hey. I'll see y'all. Mr. Cockhower, bro, you can, you, do you realize you are trying to go at a guy who called out every rapper in the world? And, and really, I believe, up church, he, he could smoke any rapper. Uh, maybe, maybe Eminem might beat him in a, in a, you know, battle. But other than that, you know, especially none of, none of the rappers out of 22 has had on, you know, no jumper. They are definitely not fucking with up church. Um, you know, just flat out. Mumble rappers cannot touch him. We all have seen what, you know, happened to old Screwface John. Um, you know, much respect to Upchurch, man. Uh, he's a beast. He's a beast at every musical style he does. But I'm telling you, this kid is slept on because he's a country boy. And, you know, he's a hillbilly killing shit in the rap game. And people hate it. You know, um, much respect, dog. You know, you know, you know, you got a lot huge following up here in Cincinnati, man. I, I always hear people bump in church, man. There's so many skins up here. Um, and, and it's like that in every state. So either way, let's get into it. Y'all seen Johnny Gobble's uh, little, you know, contradictory lies. He, you, I mean, bro, you're about to lose your family, Gobble. You know, from what I heard, your daughter had to move out of the house because you won't stop this nonsense. You say yourself. You get made fun of in different places you go in your town because of this stuff. So quit where you're ahead, bro. Go ahead, take take the little channel you got built off using Upchurch's name, switch it up, and try to do something positive. You're not going to win this one, man. Um, it's not going to happen. 
Let's get into Up Church calling out every rapper in the world. Bro, he wants that smoke, and I don't think there's anybody that's going to... He's right. They're scared. They're scared to death, especially these no-jumper rappers. They do not want no smoke. They don't want to get whipped by a hillbilly. That's why they won't put nothing on the mic. Um, and, and, you know, I, I'm a hip-hop head. I've been listening to rap. I remember when Tupac got big. I remember when Tupac got shot. I was old enough to be jamming that shit before he got shot. Uh, big, you know, I've been I've been listening to rap since I was, you know, 13, 14, something, or him being on YouTube. He's trying to call out a, a rapper who literally called out every rapper in the world recently. Um, and he's trying to, you know, go, go at him on YouTube like he's going to win somehow. It's not going to happen. Um, Johnny, I've offered to box you. You, you won't do it. I've offered to set up your own town. You could probably even make a few bucks off of it if we set up an event, um, let people come watch. And, yeah, man, let me know, Johnny. Get, get you know, grow some balls, and, and let's get in the ring. You can maybe profit from it. But let's let's get into Johnny's wife rep kicking him out over this, also calling him out on his own lies. As you can see, he contradicts himself, says he, he said he'd never talk about up church again. Then he, then he has nerve to call his wife a liar for calling him out on him saying he'd never talk about up church again and saying he's going to take a break from social media. Bro, from what I heard, your daughter moved out of the house to get away from this BS you're causing, man. There's so much more important things in life than YouTube. Johnny, bro, my offer still stands. If you want some resources to get into recovery, I will plug you in. But, man, get in the ring. Get in the ring. People would love to see you box me. You can maybe even make a few bucks from it. Um, you could promote yourself from it, but but yeah, guys, let go go tell Johnny, man, worry about his family, not Up Church. He wants to say Up Church is obsessed with him, but yet every video he makes is about Up Church, tags Up Church. Um, yeah, I've tried to go at every Up Church troll, and Johnny is just like the the rest of them. I've offered to fight every Up Church troll that he's made a video of. And these guys don't want to actually fight up church. They just want to be able to touch up church. So let's, let's just face it. Ryan's probably right. Um, I think Johnny's a little, you know what I'm saying. So, yeah, guys, go tell Johnny to man up. Show that there's a man in the Godler family and, and get in a boxing ring. But, guys, let me know what you think in the comments. As always, what we're here to do is, is let people know about recovery from addiction and clearly, Johnny needs some help. He's a perfect example of what your life looks like when it gets unmanageable. You know, your wife's kicking you out because you're obsessed with up church and whatever's going on, not saving her, whatever she was mad about him not saving. So, yeah, Johnny, man, uh, my offer still stands to you like it stands for everybody else. Anybody wants to get in recovery, drop in the comments. I'll find you resources in your area. Y'all stay up, stay sober, keep grounding, keep shining. Hit that like, subscribe if you haven't. We got content to come. Doing a lot of good things. Most recently this week, um, we were able to help a man and his three-year-old son pay their utility deposit of $150 so they could move in their apartment. They were homeless. If you go back and look, um, I made a video about two, three months back with the gentleman in it uh, talking about being homeless and his struggles with him and his son. So I'll put a clip of that video in here and I'll also link it in the comments. Y'all stay up, stay sober, keep grinding, keep shining.